Wrestling is going to be dropped from the 2020 Olympic Games. No other sport teaches young men and now young women discipline, self-reliance, fitness, nutrition. The true meaning of you're only hurting yourself. That never happens in any other sport more than it does in wrestling. I got to tell you guys. This is a disaster. You have to understand where this reaches. If you take wrestling out of the Olympics, you're effectively stripping it from college and high school. There is no pro. There is no payoff to a wrestler. That's what separates a wrestler from the pack. That's why wrestlers have chips on their shoulders. That's why they don't have friends. That's why they're spinning in cups trying to cut weight because they're doing work. And I remember my wrestling coach, Jim Sauer, used to say, basketball is a game, football is a game. What we're doing here is life. Try to get your 15-year-old son to clean his room. Try that. Now I want you to get that same kid and tell him he can only eat chicken breasts and spinach and every once in a while gorge himself on some fruit and get up when it's dark out and run five miles before school. And then when he's at school, he's going to stay at school, go to a wrestling room and grind it out. It's an amazing sport. It's the purest sport. It's the solo sport. It's a monastic life, the life of a wrestler, running alone, working alone, working with a team certainly, but working within that team structure, you are crushing it every day. You are testing yourself. And when you get uncomfortable, when you get exhausted, that's when you gotta push through. It is life itself. When you are in a wrestling room, and you're exhausted, and you feel like you're going to throw up, there's still a guy trying to take your legs out. And I got news for you, America. We live in a world, if you go to a job, someone at your job is trying to take your legs out. It's the most indicative sport of what you go through on a daily basis. Wrestling is the only sport that really gets to the core of the actual man, and the IOC is gonna take it from you. The reason you wrestle in high school is to get a scholarship to wrestle in college. And the reason you want to be so great at college is the payoff, Olympic gold. It's a sport where there is never money involved. And we talk about guaranteed contracts. We talk about how the unions are ruining the sports. You know what wrestlers are doing when all that is happening? Working, working harder than you and I ever know what work is. We were degenerates. We were bad kids. And because we got in a wrestling room and a guy taught us a bunch of takedowns and a way to defend ourselves, we had purpose. We had direction. We had focus, which became uber focus, which became hyper focus. Wrestling is the single greatest, most important thing that had ever happened to me in my entire life. Hey, I weigh 140 pounds, you weigh 140 pounds. We know the exact same moves. We train the most but who trained the most when nobody was looking? That's the guy that's gonna squeeze out a three to two win. You cannot take wrestling from us. These are the guys that are in it for one reason and one reason only, to get their hand raised in front of 14 parents in Booton, New Jersey when it's freezing cold outside. Don't let this happen. Tweet and retweet and call the IOC Tell them, safe Olympic wrestling.